Uh, well, I'm, I'm sort of begin begin by asking. This is your first sort of acting mm -hmm. acting role. You must have been uh, pretty thrilled when you got the call to be in this one. It's a it's a great break into into cinema. Yeah, it's it's quite interesting experience. You know, that's something that I never experienced and I never expected when I started studying English eight years ago. You know, I never expected to, to be in a film, in a Hollywood film. You know, and then speak in English like this. So, but yeah, it's interesting, and, and I learned many things from this experience. And but before I talked to Angie, I was not sure that I was capable. No experience in English, and then especially the story is really controversial. Is that book is not even translated in Japan, so I was not sure if I was, you know, going to tackle this role. Because it's really risky, you know. I didn't want to represent a negative side of Japan. So, but I, I met Angie in Tokyo for the first time, and she said that she wanted to create something, which could be a bridge between America and Japan. It's you know even the countries which have been having similar issues in conflict. So I thought that was really meaningful because you know, it could be happen anywhere, and it might be happening somewhere in the world. So. It's not about, you know, America and Japan or war. It's all about Luis Amprini and his message, forgiveness, and how strong a human being can be, and how strong you can fight for someone else. And then that's something that he achieved and proved in his life. So was it meeting Angelina and her explaining her ideas on the movie and, and, and sort of looking into the theme of forgiveness? Was that partly why, what sort of convinced you then to to get involved. Yes, yes, yeah, because she was so determined and then she's passionate to create this, you know, creation. Yeah, so that's why I was, I, I wanted to dedicate myself to this creation. And, and did you meet anybody, uh, uh, prisoners of war or perhaps captors themselves to sort of help you when you were researching the role? Actually, I met Louis oh. <laughs> after the film. That was a precious moment because Louis couldn't meet the bird after the war. So, to me, it was a precious moment because he welcomed me. And then I took my daughters, my family, who welcomed us. And he was so charming and clever and sharp. And he was cracking the jokes. And then he's so motivational, you know. And then I was, I was sure that I felt the forgiveness is real, yeah. you know. I was wondering as well, because I mean, the bird is, he can be quite nasty, quite quite savage at times. Was he quite a difficult character to get into into the head of and to kind of embody? Yeah, it was really difficult. Actually, you know, I had no experience, no experience as an actor, and then to get to the point, and the point was um, not to portray him as a typical villain, who is a one-dimensional. That's not what we wanted. I, Angie and me, Angie and I talked about this character a lot, and then we wanted to put depth and humanity and respect toward the character as, a, as an actual person, so, yeah. Yeah, because in a strange way, there's sort of a sort of respect, isn't there, between, well, well the bird almost has respect for, for Louis, in, in a way, there's a kind of, there's yeah. something between them, it's not a traditional hero, villain. Yeah, 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 because the bird wanted to be like Louis, and he also had a trauma in his life, and then he wanted to be loved, he wanted to, he wanted to love, but he didn't know how to do it. So that's the way you know, he did in a prison camp. And then he found a similarity. They are really alike. Mm. Yeah, and then he knew that he couldn't break down Louis. Mm. And was it, was it really helpful as a, as a newcomer in, in acting uh, to, um, to have Angelina Jolie as the director because she's such an experienced actress herself yes. that it was able to show you? A lot, the and then she knows how we feel, how we actors feel on set. And then she really cares about us. And then she's motivation and passion, you know, something that I, you know, we, we, can, we can be on the same page to achieve this creation. So it's like a team, you know, the whole team toward the same perspective. And then, yeah, she's a great artist. And then she you know, can show us you know, how we do, you know, what she wants us to do. And then I really respect her as an artist. So do you, do you plan on balancing acting and, and music from here on? Yeah, yeah, I feel more responsible, responsibility to make a good album as a musician. 
and then with a good message. And I learned many things from this experience. And um, I would love to keep continuing acting if there's an opportunity. Brilliant. Well, thank you so much for your time. Much thank appreciated. You. Thank, thank you. you. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys! Hey You Guys, huh? Hey you guys, Is that yeah. from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey!